dissatisfied. That is how commuters in Chennai feel about this year's railway budget. The Railway Minister Lalu Prasad Yadav has announced a 7% investment leap for this year. But people in Chennai feel that the southern railways have been overlooked in his plans. A whopping sum of almost 38,000 crores have been allocated for the railways this year. And 43 new trains will be introduced. However, Chennai adds question as to where the money is being spent on. Mr. Yadav is one such commuter who regularly travels by train. Every day, he travels 10 kilometers to work. He doubts whether this year's railway budget will make things easier for him. He says that instead of running new trains and reducing fares, money should be spent on improving infrastructure. The trains are overcrowded, so it needs more uh, coaches or more trains, population increasing, more people are traveling. And uh, from many point of view, this mass transport has to be improved. We spoke to the senior PR officer of Southern Railways about the budget. He was unhappy that new trains on important routes were not being introduced for Tamil Nadu. He says that none of the eight double line rail tracks announced in the budget were reserved for Tamil Nadu. These commuters are angry that high speed bullet trains are not being introduced on the Madurai Chennai Kanyakumari route. But railway officials say that six people died when test runs were being conducted to introduce these bullet trains. As a result, the plan was stalled. The number of railway accidents have come down over the past year from 325 to 194. But railway staff say that people continue to cross rail tracks and thus become victims of accidents due to the lack of security on railway stations. Even as the railway budget comes with its share of promises, commuters down south say that they have been given a raw deal.